Is that plastic back or is that wood? What are those this made? is the plastic one, yeah. I like your handles on some of the boxes. Yeah, the exterior ones are yeah. really nice. That's very nice. Otherwise, the other ones, you're kind of working with your fingertips. Exactly. Yep. So we'll take a look and see what we got here for problems. Again, we'll start on the second one over here. We don't see any eggs here. They've got enough honey and they've got pollen. See, they're pretty docile. They come and land on you because you're warm from the sun. You got something else to test my bees. Smell that pheromone too from hmm. the bees. Uh, yeah, I don't see any eggs at all. Can you combine it with the, the new package? Yep, we could do that. Here's some. Do some eggs? This looks like drones. And there's some eggs in here. But notice one thing. All the ones that they've laid, see how big they are? Mm -hmm. They're all drones. See that one? Oh. See, that. see, this is a drone egg. Oh. Here's one that they're bringing up. Because it's a mound So you don't know who's laying So either hmm. the queen is out of sperm and the bees aren't really excited about that or they got laying workers in here. Now laying workers usually have two or three eggs in one cell. Here. So you have to examine a little closer. I see some eggs. Oh yeah. Wish you could all see this. It's got an egg on the side oh. of the cell. So this has got laying workers, hmm. so you can't really requeen that. You want to pass that around. They don't have any fertilized eggs. Oh. Oh. So they'll just keep laying drones, and drones don't do anything. We feed them. And so what will you do with it then, Bob? I will combine it with a pack. Here's the queen. Oh, yeah. So why is she laying drones? Is it drones? possible she can see out of juice, refertile? Get, you know. See, she isn't marked. She will never mate again okay. after the first week of her life. Yeah. Hmm. And I wonder. She's running around like crazy. You see her? Yeah. yeah. Big one, oh, big yeah. one on yeah. top. Yeah. Right on top. Yeah. And you just it's never fun to do to kill her. You know, so when you have laying workers, you it's it? safe to do that. Yeah, yeah. 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 it's the seven. only way to come around. Yeah, they won't kill that new queen. No, I'm not going to get a new queen. I'm no going to take the bees out of here and shake them over a package so they go in that package. Hard. Okay. Once you've already uh, let the queen loose in the package, Todd? I'm no. going to kill the queen before I. No, the new queen that comes with the package. Yeah. So. Will she already be released before you yeah. shake those? Okay. She'll be able to be released and accepted by that group. Yeah. Yeah. Won't these guys always want to come back here? Aren't they? they? May. Yeah, some of them will. But that's all you can do, really. Yeah. Or I could take them over from oh, the three other. miles yeah. away and dump them in there. Could you set the new package right here in a hive? You could. And then at least the bees somewhat. Mm -hmm. They got their idea. own house. Yep. And this Crystal. is that Crisco and sugar. Powdered sugar or just, just granular sugar? Yeah. So and you just like put it right where the bees are. And they're going to they're gonna eat the sugar out of here. In the meantime, they'll get that Crisco on them. And that'll confuse the tracheal mites so they don't transfer between bees. In uh, two or three weeks, that'll all be gone. I just put another patty in. So the tracheal mites actually crawl on the surface of the hive and then get to another uh, uh, breathing tube? Or yep. Yep. Is that they how hang they on to a bee and then when another bee gets next to them they transfer over to the I see. And get in the tracheal tubes and uh, propagate again and suffocate them. I see, but if they have that slippery uh, Crisco on them it's... Uh, well, get it's, back it's in the, the odor of it rather than the slippery. It's the odor of the Crisco. Uh, confuses the mites I and they can't find the next bee. And that's good, that, that amount that was three tablespoons, how long is that going to last? Probably 
you know, career. depending on how many bees you got. Yeah. Like about three weeks or so. Okay. And then the next time you're in there, you just pop another one. Out. Do it all year. All well, summer long. And it doesn't melt. It doesn't melt, and the bees yeah. carry it away. They get the sugar content out of it. Crisco and two tablespoons of sugar. Got it. Okay. And if it gets too crumbly, then you put more Crisco. In. Just so it hangs together yeah. not like that. Is it mint supposed to be a, a factor with the mites too? There's a lot of homemade things that beekeepers are trying. Yeah. Tobacco, mint, and all that stuff. But it's not been scientifically tested, so that's why we can't say it really works. Yeah.